comedy hour. Um, and I'm sure we don't have anything else going on, so that's good. Now, you guys, it's so great to be here. So great to see your faces. You guys, give it up. You're amazing. So good to see you. Well, actually, I don't want to see all your faces. Can some of you pull up those masks, please? I, I see noses. It is so good to be here, guys. Um, you know, quarantine was weird, wasn't it? It was a little bit weird. Um, I know I had French fries for breakfast. Um, yeah, and I kept a McDouble in the <laughs> crisper. I kept it in the veggie crisper because I knew my husband wouldn't look in there. So. <laughs> Um, I outgrew my leggings. Anybody else? <laughs> Quarantine 15? 50? Yeah. yeah, nothing personal. It happens. Um, but no, I, I mean, it's fine. I, I, yeah, I outgrew my leggings. We finished Netflix. So <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> All of it. Um, we are working on, we're about three quarters through Hulu now. So <laughs> doing well. Um, I don't know if you guys realize this, but Costco stopped selling their uh, sheet cakes. Did you guys know that? No. They did. Yes, this is a true story. Um, during quarantine, <laughs> they wanted to stop selling sheet cakes because they were trying to prevent large gatherings. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, um, I'm sorry. I did not realize that a sheet cake was not a single serving. <laughs> Anybody else? Because I had no idea about that. Um, I used to see a sheet cake and just pull up with a spoon and a fork. So I didn't realize that. And Costco, you don't know my life. So stay out of my business. So anyway, guys, um, I am married to a bus driver. Guys, give it up for Barry. Yes, he is amazing. I love my husband, he is a wonderful person, um, and he drives all of your kids in North Kansas City schools. So guys, give it up for bus drivers, and, <laughs> and cafeteria custodians, everybody who's amazing, um, he is wonderful. Um, you know, a lot of times he'll come home, uh, you know, I'm like, hey baby, how was your day? And he's like, well, <laughs> I drive a classroom on wheels. <laughs> yeah, so. And, Hunter uh, licked his candy cane into a fine point and tried to stab Jimmy. <laughs> so that happened. Um, so he's always in a good mood. <laughs> and he makes a ton of money. Just a ton. I said, baby, you don't have to make 100K, but K would be nice. So. <laughs> like that. Sometimes we'll just cash his paycheck and come home and just dance in the woods. <laughs> and like that. But anyway. <laughs> I got the moves, baby. I really don't. Um... <laughs> Are you guys excited about Halloween? Yeah. That is a mask I'm okay wearing, man. That's gonna be awesome. I love it. I love it. Now, I'm super pro mask. I really am. And I'm so glad. I'm so proud of you guys for always wearing them. Um, and I'm just so excited about Halloween because we are Star Wars nerds. We're my Star Wars nerds. Yeah. That is awesome. You guys, we are Star Wars nerds and we like to dress up a little bit, kind of do some cosplay, you know, go to those. Uh, conventions and stuff. And so my husband and I, you know, he's my Han Solo. <laughs> and I'm his Chewbacca. <laughs> it's good. No, he, he's so sweet. I love him. Guys, I mean, and it's great to, you know, have a wonderful husband in my life, you know, just to have a partner. Clap it up if you have someone who loves you for who you are. Yeah. Yeah. And you other bitter folks, I'm sorry. <laughs> this little piggy's off the market. <laughs> That's right, baby, I'm chubby, taken, and ready for bacon. So. <laughs> That's right. I shop at the plus size store. Yes, I do, guys. Ho, ho, ho. Lane Giant. <laughs> it's called Lane Bryant. 
they shortened it. Um, they were uh, kind of upset because they said, oh, people know we're plus size, you know. So um, they shortened it to LB. I said, baby, that's pounds. Okay. <laughs> You're not fooling me, honey. I'm from Kansas, okay? I, I want the land of Oz, right, baby? Mama needs ounces. Okay. <laughs> You guys, shopping is absolutely crazy. There's always some slender lady, and she's like, oh my God, I only work here because I got fired from Express. <laughs> I'm like, I only shop here because I just got back from Panda Express. <laughs> Sorry about that. I go in there for a swimsuit. She's like, you want a one piece or a two piece? I'm like, give me a six piece and a biscuit. <laughs> and a Diet Coke. Because uh, I don't want to get fat. <laughs> oh. If you're laughing at that, you're kind of mean. Um, <laughs> I guess you don't realize that obesity is hereditary. I've got my dad's green eyes and my mom's orange Cheeto fingers. That's right, baby, it's in my DNA. <coughs> Donuts, nachos, and apple pie. <laughs> so, where are my teachers? Once again, give me love, give, give some love. <laughs> that is what I'm screaming. I am just so happy, guys. We're so happy to be back, and we're so happy to have our scholars here. And our brand new principal, Dr. Tate, give him a shot. It is wonderful. Um, you know, and I've been happily teaching for 19 years. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. Yes. Teaching English. And uh, it's, it's pretty fun, um, except for the kids are just not as into reading as they used to be, darn it, because they're on their phones and whatevs. And so all my kids, every time I'm ready for a new novel unit, I'm like, man, I just want to watch the movie. Well, it just shows the movie. So now I only teach books that have really good movies. <laughs> We're currently reading Kung Fu Panda. <laughs> Two. <laughs> yeah. And I think, um, you know, Unit 2 will probably get into, like, Great Men in History. Paul Blart Mall Cop. So. <laughs> We're getting there. We're getting there. No, I, I do. I, I love teaching. Um, I really do. I have some kids. They have really unusual names. Um, I had three girls, China, India, and Malaysia, all in one class. And they fought every day. <laughs> every day. It's like the UN in my classroom. No. But teaching can be kind of stressful, right? It can be kind of hard. It, it can be, right? You know, um, it really, it, you know, it, it can be a little bit stressful, but it's okay. Um, I see happy people in the hallways. <laughs> the gym teachers. <laughs> oh, yeah. No shade to the gym teachers, okay? But that is a beautiful life. That is a beautiful life, guys. Thank you. Um, yes, thank you. <laughs> I love gym teachers, okay? They always look happy. They just come into the break room, just their whistle swinging. <laughs> we just got done with the square dancing unit. <laughs> and I think I'm so excited because next week we're going to be doing the parachute. <laughs> Have you ever seen someone look unhappy doing the parachute? I mean, come on, you guys, didn't you love the parachute yeah. when you were young? Wasn't that just the best unit ever? They're like... <sighs> <laughs> to the gym teachers, like I said. Um, but I want that life because I'm an English teacher, so I have six bags on me at all times. <laughs> and they're very heavy. <laughs> and I'm just like, 
woo, I got a lot to grade. And, uh, and you know, and they're adorable, and, but here's the thing. Um, they say, dress for the job that you want, not the job you have. So I've been wearing sweatpants and whistles every day. <laughs> Whistle swinging, it's fun. <laughs> it's all good. No, I love it. I love it. And I have some kids, you know, they're resistant, sometimes reluctant to learn, and that's okay. We'll get you on board. We'll get you on board. I had one little guy who was like, I don't need any of this grammar and stuff. I'm going to be a rap star. And I was like, okay, we'll sit down and do some semicolons. Um, we're going to get this going. And he's like, you know, if you were a rapper, they'd call you two chins. <laughs> I was like, oh, heck no, they wouldn't. They'd call me Little Debbie. <laughs> That's right, baby, because I'm the original snap rapper. <laughs> I never met a ho-ho I didn't like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> no way. So I said, no, baby, I would be Little Debbie. You guys want to hear just a tiny little bit of a rap today? Yeah. Yeah. Shout out to my peeps at Applebee's and KFC. Let's do this. <laughs> I'm the hostess with the mostest. I'm going to get right on it. Let's get the party started. Let me get my bonnet. They call me Little Debbie because I am so sweet. Got sugar in my veins. Splendid in my feet. Are you feeling it? Yeah. Are you feeling it? Great feeling it. Great feeling it. <laughs>